I don't uh, I don't know if you're, you're familiar, Neil, with any of the, the boys in the ring just now. Um, Scott Jaffa Jarvey coming out of the Los Obama camps had uh, quite a lot of success recently. He's been knocking out quite a lot of his opponents. Um, and Toby from the blue corners a, a well. He's a seasoned fighter. He's been fighting for quite a while now. He's uh, very, very calm and very, very tough. Well, straight into it, uh, Toby Douglas there is trying to press the action a little bit and go right early with the hands. I think uh, Scott's looking for, uh, he's landing big tower, but Toby is uh, he's walking straight forward into Scott's fight here. Not, not much work in the clinch there, so it's been separated. Again, Toby pressing forward. That was a nice time uh, there, low kick there, by uh, Scott Jarvey. Yeah, Jeff has, um, he, he, looks, he looks like he's turned up today, he's nice and light on his feet, and uh, Toby doesn't seem to be landing very, very anything. In fact, I don't think he's landed anything clean so far in the fight. Well, he's, uh, he's standing up a little bit now. Yeah, you know, we definitely see that Jeff is uh, the uh, sharper of the two, so far, anyway. Toby, Toby looks a little bit, just a little flat footed here. I think he needs to um, start moving a little more because Scott is nice and light and if he's going to land, he's going to have to get very, very sharp. Again, very that's, uh, that looked nicely timed there. Just took him off his balance without right causing any damage. Scott's hands are like really, really low. I, I don't know if he's got a nice bit of confidence in him. That was very nice. And, uh, that was very nice. And that's the end of the first. And that's rightly so, it was a fantastic leg kick, tight, uh, well, well timed taking Toby down there. Um, well, so so far, it can only go one way. I would definitely say that uh, Jaffa seems to have done the, uh, the crisper work, landed the most shots and some very nicely timed leg kicks. Scott, um, Scott has brought a massive, massive bout um, with him there. There's one absolutely mental over the right shoulder. Yes. He's, uh, he's brought his whole, his whole army with him tonight. Seems to be a very popular fighter. If he's, uh, he's, uh, if he's doing well uh, recently, he's, uh, he's brought that following with him. What do you think they'll be sending it with him in the blue corner then, uh, Kev? I think they're going to have to be telling him that he needs to score better techniques. He looks like he's rushing forward with his hand a bit too much and uh, he does need to score with his legs. Um, if, if he can score with his legs, I think he can, uh, he can turn this one around quite early, so at least he'll have a better fighting chance towards the later rounds if we go that far. Let's see what we can do in the second round. Yeah, straight away a little bit lighter on his toes. Then leg kicks land again. So they landed a big left hook there, but that leg kick is uh, it's going to be a massive tail to his side. Toby's dropping his hands after he throws, which is when he's getting caught by Jaffa. Yeah, Jaffa's been, he landed a few, a few nice uh, clean hands there, nice left hook. He just seems to be all the way to the uh, looser of the fighters, uh, Jaffa, and quite relaxed. Oh, a massive left foot from Toby there. Yeah, Scott's looking for that lead leg constantly, just inside, trying to unbalance Toby every time he steps in. I think, uh, I think Toby needs to uh, use his legs to, to get in there a little bit more. Uh, he seems to have a little bit of success with that. Yeah, Scott's hands have really dropped low now. He's literally got no guard at all, it's uh, the down by his side. A left hook came from his, uh, from his hips. Exchanging the legs now. That left hook connected, very nice. Yep, Toby's being caught with the, the, the clean left hook every time he steps in and the inside leg kicks. I, I think he, uh, he'll need to reconsider his game plan so far. That's the end of the second. Very eventful, what do you think of that one, Neil? I think uh, Jeff is uh, again, maybe he's edged that round, um, he did the crisper work, he just really needs to pick his hands up and have them round by his chin. Um, he's relying a little bit on his reflexes there, but he's getting caught every now and again. Um, I think with Toby, if he, uh, if he uses his legs a little bit more to set his punches up instead of uh, just trying to walk in, uh, he might have a little bit more success. Toby's looking a little bit frustrated. Um, he's as we've seen so far, he seems to be favouring his hands. I don't know if he's uh, 
looking specifically for the knockout, but I, I think he's stretching a wee bit too far for it just now. He's not really trying to break Scott down in any way. He's just really stepping in, trying to stop the fight. It's catching him. Um, he just needs to work himself in a little bit smarter, and he might get the, that big punch landed. And coming into round three now, um, Toby's uh, right eye is starting to swell up and a bit of bruising nice and early, so Scott has definitely got some heavy, heavy hands on him. Yeah, he's uh, sitting overhand right, he's starting to throw there. Still nice and light on his feet though, um, Jaffa. Yes. That's a nice one too, Andy. Again, another right hand. Third right on the trot there. Jaffa's mouth is uh, really wide open, he's, he's got his gum shield hanging loose in his, uh, in his teeth there, I think he, he might be feeling a wee bit of the, the pace right now, I mean, the guys did start pretty, pretty fast for uh, the first fight of the night. They have, yeah, they have. Eager to please. That was nice and tired. Nice right hook. Yeah, so far Javi is definitely controlling the pace of the fight, he's, he's making Toby miss. It's a, really nice it's a very fast pace fight, very fast, he's heating up even more. Yeah, Toby is very, very game, he, he, we know he's, these shots must be hurting, they're landing in front of us and they look very, very heavy, but uh, he seems to just be shrugging them off and she's still stepping forward. He does, he does. He's timing that nice low kick uh, very well. A wee bit of flash there from Toby, just yeah. missing. Answer with an, uh, a nice, uh, nice straight hand there. Very eventful that I thought again, Scott is just edging this, he's just unbalancing Toby uh, just at critical times towards the end of the round there, unbalanced him a few times with the inside leg kick as Toby was stepping forward. He's, def he's definitely doing, for me, he's definitely doing a cleaner work out the two. Uh, you can't knock Toby's heart mind because he keep, keeps clubbing forward, keeps trying to push the pace. Uh, but the cleaner work uh, done by uh, Scott Jaffa Jarby there. Just looking over at Toby in his corner there, his face is getting quite uh, quite marked up now. At this moment, uh, Scott Jaffa Jarby looks, um, looks to be relatively unscathed uh, to the face anyway. He does, yeah. Um, he's, he's not marked up at all. Uh, Toby, he's, he's made it really hard for Toby in the first few rounds there. Uh, Toby hasn't really landed anything of great significance, a few left hooks, but nothing that, uh, that's really scored any greatly so far in the fight. They're into the clinch there, not, not a lot of work coming from both of them, I'm not surprised the referee is separating it there. I'm surprised that Toby's stopping uh, the clinch and taking Scott's lower back there, I, I thought he would have, uh, considering he's losing the fight on the outside, uh, maybe try getting in there and, and seeing if they can overpower him. Once again, Scott's landing big kicks and big legs. Nice this ah, time, very well nice. Time. Straight through the middle there, straight through the guard. And Once again. again. That was a good shot, that was a big shot. And Toby's okay, I think he's just, uh, he knew that one landed, but he looks quite fine. I'd expect Scott to come rushing out of the neutral corner now to get the stoppage. Corner turns straight through the middle again, see if he can do what they're telling. Yeah, Toby's stepping forward, he's, he's looking at the hot spot back now. It's really heating up this match. Oh, oh what a nice hook. Second count here from the referee. He's handing it through for the Scott Jaffa Jarby. I think Jaffa's in, I think he's just looking a bit more fit, a bit more, uh, he's just lighter on his toes, you know, and he's landing very, very well. Just a bit sharper. I think uh, Toby was lucky that he got away with such a long count there. Yeah. Nice round, nice round that for Scott Jarvie. Some lovely time techniques. I was, um, uh, yeah, he really, he really dropped his uh, shoulder going into the, with a big straight left there. Landed three times clean in Toby's face. Um, I wonder what his corner's telling him now. He's going to have to pick it up and do something in this, uh, this, uh, this next round. Uh, because uh, for me, so far, it's been uh, Jaffa Jarvie doing all this uh, very nice, clean work. Yeah, definitely, I agree with you there.
turning around five here. I think Kobe will come straight forward looking for the knockout now, but Scott looks to be doing the same. It's much of the same here. Kobe stepping forward. Nice body hook and left hook there from Kobe. And a rover hand right. Oh, that was a nice one. Nice, yeah, right the fight's over there. Very Massive nice. uppercut there from Scott Javi. And uh, the crowd went a bit mental coming up to ringside here. Yeah. Sharp, the punches won the order of the day there. Yeah. I think Kobe's okay. I think it was. Uh, it was just a, a shot that buckled his knees there. He, he looks fine, his eyes are clear and everything. Just a bit off balance, a bit dazed. Uh, I think he's recovered fairly sh uh, sharp this day. He's uh, up on his feet, nice sportsmanship there. Straight to, uh, straight to Scott to give him a hug. A massive win for Scott Harvey there. Um, another knockout for his record. <laughs>